Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Carlos and thanks so much for stopping by my channel, Brooklyn Fragrance Lover. Today I'll be reviewing three fragrances from a brand called Wise Guys Cologne. Keep it right there. I met OG Gabriel, the founder of Wise Guys Cologne, on Facebook. He's involved in the fragrance groups, he does splits, really nice guy. I'll be honest, I really didn't look to try his stuff because I thought maybe it was a novelty collection or something. I recently saw some reviews on YouTube and I thought maybe this is for real. So I reached out to him and he was more than happy to send me product. He wanted to send me full bottles, but I said no, just send me samples and we'll take it from there. So within days, I get this big old fat package in the mail. I'm like, samples? What is this? I open it up. It smells amazing, the whip that came out of there. Inside was a Wise Guys Cologne t-shirt, a keychain, um, a poker chip, and this is his idea of samples. Very generous, thank you. He also hand wrote a little brief to me. I'll read some of it to you. I have gyms for seniors here in Vegas and Palm Springs, California. I reside in Vegas full time and started the Wise Guys group as a movement to bring back the class style and elegance that we once had. The fragrances and our dress shirts is only a reflection and a start of who we are and what we represent. We would like to bring back the style and the class of the noir era, 1940s, 1950s. Smell our fragrances and it will transport you back to this, that time. From the way we dress to the way we manage ourselves to the way we smell transfers into our wise guys reality without lacking anyone. <laughs> He's got a sense of humor too. I'll just read you this last thing that he wrote. Come to Vegas. We will treat you to dinner and a Vegas show. We enjoy your reviews and your passion to our fragrance world. Thank you, OG Wise Guys Las Vegas. In the 1980s, before starting his fragrance company, OG had a popular gym in California that was frequented by many stars such as Frank Sinatra, Kirk Douglas. Here are some pictures that he sent. Here's him with Sylvester Stallone, I was going to say Rambo, <laughs> and with Arnold, cool stuff. So let's get to the fragrances. We'll start off with Vegas Cologne. The notes are whiskey, caramel, honey, cocoa, sweet pipe tobacco, and vanilla bourbon. I would definitely classify Vegas as a gourmand, a sweet gourmand. It opens big and boozy. You definitely get the caramel, you definitely get the sweet pipe tobacco, but it's never overbearingly sweet. It's masculine. It's a masculine sweetness, if that makes any sense. It's rich, it's full, and a really nice fragrance for the colder months, I think. I put it on before I went to bed and I could still smell it in the morning. I was really blown away by this one. Quite a surprise and one of the best independent perfumes that I've sniffed in quite a while. The notes for OG, A Scent of Elegance, are Lemon, Orange Blossom, Bergamot, Jasmine, Heliotrope, Lily of the Valley, Light Cinnamon, Vetiver, Amber, Vanilla, Chonka Bean, Cedar, Sandalwood, and Tobacco. Whereas Vegas Cologne leans a little younger, I think that OG, A Scent of Elegance, leans a little more mature. The fragrance is rich, it's full, the florals aren't overly heady, I get mostly jasmine on my skin. There's a subtle sweetness, but it's definitely a masculine fragrance for sure. Just wasn't my favorite on my skin of the three that OG sent me. I can see this smelling great on somebody else, and definitely it's a lot better than a lot of the designer stuff that I've been sniffing lately. Well done, just not my favorite on my skin. Wise Guys Cologne were commissioned to create a signature fragrance for Vegas. What they came up with is called Vegas Signature Sinfully Scented. The notes are bergamot, neroli, spicy ginger, coconut, cinnamon, sweet tobacco, cashmere, tonka bean, rum, honey, caramel, and vanilla.
I really, really enjoyed Vegas Signature Sinfully Scented. It opens bright and fresh with the bergamot and neroli. You get the coconut, a little bit of a tropical vibe, but then you start getting the gourmand and sweet notes, but never too sweet or too fruity or anything. Just really nice. I'd classify this more as a fresh fragrance, and I can see it more for the summer months, but really, really well done. I liked it a lot. Would you like to try Wise Guys Cologne? Thanks to the generosity of OG, we are offering one lucky subscriber a chance to win a full bottle of your choice. All you have to do is subscribe to Brooklyn Fragrance Lover, like and share this video, follow Wise Guys Cologne on Facebook, then leave one comment down below with which fragrance interests you the most. Good luck. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Take care.